Hey guys, welcome to another edition of OMD and um, the dive site reviews. Today we're going to do a dive at Abadez and Ola's going to do the dive briefing for you. So sit back and enjoy and remember to hit that subscribe button. Hey, we're Ola and Marty and together we're OMD. OMD. Scuba diving instructors with 12 years of combined experience. Join us every week as we share part of our diving life, tips, tricks, dive site and gear reviews that we hope will inspire you. But for now, gear up, subscribe and enjoy this episode of OMD. Hey guys, today we're going to dive in Abades. It's a shallow dive, perfect for open waters, tri divers and people who would like to test their um, setup on the new gear. Uh, Abades is a beautiful place for marine life and also a nursery for newborn uh, fish, um, rays and other species like angel sharks. Um, so we will enter from the beach. Uh, we start shallow, the uh, deepest bit will be 13 to 15 meters. However, majority of the dive will be approximately six to seven meters. So on this dive, most probably you'll be doing a safety stop if you actually exceed 10 meters you'll be doing a safety stop while swimming back to the shore. Um, as you can see on the map, uh, it's a beautiful rock formation um, that uh, creates a beautiful place for um, small fish, large fish, stingrays. This is actually a um, great opportunity to come here in May because that's the breeding seasons for uh, stingrays and you can actually see loads of them. Um, let's go through the safety and signals. Um, so signals everything's okay something's wrong and then point what's wrong we go up we go down we check our gouges and this is the sign this is 100 this is 50 bar and each finger will be 10. Um, as it comes to safety we stay in buddy teams or in in pairs uh, if you ever get lost uh, the the drill is to look around for a minute and then if you can't find your group or your buddy you surface obviously remaining the safety procedure. So gear up and let's go. about this and um, I just wanted to ask you what was your favorite bit well 
My favourite bit today was seeing the porcupine puffer fish um, hiding uh, in between the rocks and I think you got some amazing videos on that so yeah we'll put that in as well. Yeah it's I gonna loved be it. Fantastic. It was it was actually pretty big mm. for the porcupine standard sizes it was one of the biggest one I saw. Nice nice. Yeah. What about yourself what was your favourite oh, thing that we saw today? Every time I go to Abadis dive site my favourites are razor uh, no well razor fish yes as well because they're beautiful for color, color. but um, I would say the common pandoras it's the silver fish that uh, tends to follow you through the whole dive so it kind of creates the bond and it's so nice to have a companion <laughs> yeah yeah I love it it was it was so funny when you signaled me to tell me about it and I just turned around and it was just right there it yeah was... they have a very funny way of swimming also because they follow and then when you turn around they stop so it looks pretty funny it's like a game as a kid <laughs> it is yeah, yeah, yeah exactly yeah but besides this uh, we haven't actually uh, seen this time amazing place for sea turtles there are patches of uh, seagrass mm. and uh, sea turtles tend to come over to feed mm. and also in the, the seagrass there um, a lot of the time in round about May as well you get a lot of uh, baby cuttlefish or oh, little sapia yeah great so, nursery so yeah, yeah it's fantastic plenty of marine life I, I, I think I love that dive for a few reasons mm -hmm. um, one, not just that it's easy, but it's just so beautiful, you know, and there's yeah. so much life there. And if you ever just want to just kind of chill and want a really just nice, easy dive, yeah. perfect place something for pretty. it. Yeah, something, something pretty. Something pretty and easy. easy. Yes. Yeah, it's just beautiful. Great also for uh, checking new setups of your gear, Definitely. practicing buoyancy, mm. uh, doing some skills as an extra practice. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and you know, because it's so shallow, the natural light that you know comes through yeah. creates beautiful beautiful colors so perfect for photos as well yeah yeah the big school of damsels at the end of the, yes. the rock formations always it's yeah. like being in an aquarium yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> i also once saw a flying fish there oh nice yeah pretty interesting to see it actually walking on the bottom <laughs> Yeah. All right, guys. Well, that's it for today's episode. So please write us a comment if you liked it or if there's any dive sites you want us to film mm -hmm. here in Tenerife. And um, we'll try and get onto that. Don't forget to subscribe and like our channel. Yeah. Stay tuned. S have a great week. Ciao for now. Okay.